Hi guys and welcome back to another video and in this video we're going to be talking about the triple DES encryption in Python. So we've seen in previous videos the DES and the AES encryption using the PyCryptodome package in Python and in this video we're going to have a look on the triple DES encryption using the same package which is PyCryptodome. So basically a triple DES is encrypting using DES but three times as the name suggests. So it's going to be a series of encryption then decryption and then encryption. So obviously we have uh, pretty much three options for the keys. So the first option is that we have three different keys meaning that we have a key for the first encryption and then a key for the decryption and then another third key for the second encryption. Another option is having only two keys. So we're encrypting using key one, then decrypting using key two, then encrypting again using key one. And the third option is that we only have one key. So we encrypt, then decrypt, then encrypt, which is actually going to eventually be a single DES encryption. So the third option is is not used and it's not supported as well by the this package. So in this video we're gonna have a look on using option one which is actually having three keys. And how are we going to decide that we're using uh, whether option one or two it's actually based on the length of the triple DES key. So a single DES uses a key of eight bytes, uh, of eight bytes. The length of the key is eight bytes. However, uh, if we're using a triple DES key of 24 bytes, then this means that we're actually having three keys, each of length eight bytes. However, if we use a triple DES key of length 16 bytes, then this means that we actually have two keys. So we're using the second option. So for the sake of this tutorial, we're going to be using a uh, key of length 24. So we're applying the first option, which is actually having three different keys uh, for the uh, encryption. Without further ado, let's get into the code. Okay, so the first thing to do is actually install the PyCryptodome package. So to do this, in the terminal, we're gonna need to type pip install PyCryptodome. I already have it installed, so nothing is gonna be done at my side. Once you have the package installed, then you're ready to go on. So the first thing to do is actually importing the uh, triple DES from CryptoDome package. So from crypto.cipher import DES3. And the next thing to do is importing a uh, random key generator method that is defined in the uh, CryptoDome package as well. So from crypto.random import get underscore random underscore bytes. Okay, so the first thing to do is actually generating the key. So in a while loop, while true, we're going to try to generate the key. So try key is equal to des3 dot just underscore key underscore parity. And this method actually uh, takes as a parameter the bytes uh, which represent the key. So we're gonna call the get random bytes, get underscore random underscore bytes, and then give it the length of our key. So we're using option one, which is having three different keys. So obviously we're going to provide 24 here in the length of the uh, bytes. So once we successfully generate the key, we wanna break this while loop. Otherwise, we're gonna accept value error, then we're going to pass in order to try to generate again the key. 
So the next thing to do now is defining the increp method, which is gonna take the plain text as a parameter and return the cipher text along with the nonce. So def encrypt, which is gonna take the message, and then we're gonna now uh, create our cipher object. So cipher is equal to des3.new, which takes the key as a parameter along with the mode of operation. So I'm gonna use uh, the EAX mode. So I'm gonna type in here des3.mode underscore EAX. And the nonce is gonna be equal to cipher.nonce. And now the cipher text is gonna be equal to cipher.encrypt. So we're gonna call the encrypt method on the cipher object and we're gonna give it as a parameter our message, but it takes the message as bytes. So we're gonna type in here message.encode. We're gonna encode the message in ASCII. Okay, so now we have the cipher text. What we need to do is actually return the nonce and the cipher text. Okay, so we're done with the encrypt method. Let's now create the decrypt method. So def decrypt, which is obviously gonna take the nonce along with the cipher text. So the first thing to do is forming the cipher object. So cipher is equal to des3.new, which is gonna take the key as a parameter and the mode of operation, which is des3.mode underscore eax, and then it's gonna actually take the nonce also. So nonce is equal to nonce. Okay, the second thing to do is getting the plain text. So plain text is gonna be equal to cipher.decrypt which takes the cipher text. And remember that the plain text now is actually bytes. So we need to decode it. So return plain text dot decode. And then we used ASCII encoding. So we're gonna be using ASCII in the decoding as well. Okay, so now we're done with the encrypt and decrypt. Let's now uh, create the code to take the input from the user and then encrypt it and then decrypt it. So uh, obviously we're gonna call the encrypt method which returns the nonce in cipher. So nonce cipher text is equal to encrypt and then we're gonna give it the message. So let's take the message from the user. So I'm gonna type in here input and then give the message. So enter a message. And then the uh, plain text is going to be equal to decrypt of the nonce and the cipher text. Let's now print out the uh, cipher text and the plain text. So cipher text, cipher text, and here the plain text, plain text, right? Okay, so uh, let's test this out. So what we need to do is type here Python and then our file name, so main.py, error, let's enter a message. Hey guys, welcome to this tutorial. Okay, here we go. So uh, this is our message. Hey guys, welcome to this tutorial. And this is the cipher text encrypted using the triple des encryption with a uh, different three keys, a triple des key of total length 24 bytes. And then here is the decoded or the decrypted uh, plain text. Hey guys, welcome to this tutorial. Okay, so uh, that's it guys for this tutorial and catch you in the next one.